Hi guys, I am Trish with Unique Me 303 Healing and Empowerment. This message is going to be for the week ahead. I've already shuffled them and laid them out so that we can just go ahead and get right into this. So the first card that came out for us is your hard work is paying off. This is a new moon and Capricorn card. And this is what um, I'm feeling from this. There's a lot of energy that has been shifting lately, pushing people forward um, into uh, new experiences, into fulfillment of uh, money and financial um, obligations are, are changing. So meaning like you've been putting in the time and energy on the suggestions of what spirit has been given you and the direction it's been asking you to go in. You've been doing that. So, you know, there's a lot of change that's coming for you, a push forward uh, into uh, positive ways of being, but I'm also seeing the honeybee, which is about hard work, dedication, commitment, things of that sort. So I think I've already shared like two videos about this today. This is a major energy that's going on right now. Take the wave as it is right on this surge because it's not going to come back up again for a while. So no procrastination, no laziness, nothing like that. Conclusions are within your, in your reach. So you're closer and closer to your goal of the things that you want to manifest, what it is that you want for your entrepreneurship practices or business um, endeavors or what have you. Some of you are really getting into a space of uh, creative ideals, pushing forward with those when it comes to entrepreneurship and some sort of business opportunity with self. Nothing is yet set in stone. There are still things that are being uh, worked out so to speak, things are being tweaked. There's adjustments that need to be made, things of that sort. However, there are some of you that have been expecting that things should go a certain way. And then now they're flip-flopping to go a completely different way. Most of you, this is for the better is what I am hearing. So just go with the flow is what this is asking you to do. There's a lot of things that are being unseen at this time because of timing. Um, if it's not the right timing, guys, you're not going to manifest what it is that you want. Even if you've been putting time and energy into being positive, visualizing what it is that you want, speaking it into reality 202. Look that up on Sacred Scribes. Either way it goes, things are being kept from you for a reason, okay? You'll start to see because those, those, um, uh, the answers to whatever it is that you've been seeking or the solutions for them are coming to you, okay? Timing is everything. Just know that. Um, things are going to be even better is what I'm hearing. Now, some of you may feel like you're in a relationship where there is a lot of secrets being cut from you, or maybe there, you are suspecting that there's a third party, um, in your relationship. Just ask for confirmation about this. Have spirit show you through the people, places, and things what you need to do about this situation or to reveal the truth to you. The return of Aphrodite is about seeing your the beauty that is within yourself, others seeing and being attracted to your light, your beauty, uh, the presence that you present to other people. It's all about you seeing and other people seeing your beauty. So returning back to that, I'm told to tell you it's a number 13.